What's going on, Z Warriors? Mr. Waffles here. We're here with uh, one of the top finishers of today's tournament. Um, what's your name? Uh, my name is Shim. And what deck were you playing? I played Orange Goku. Wow, oh, Orange Goku, you know. Goku and his friends. Goku and, Goku and friends. That's cute. So I'm just going to run through the deck and we'll just go through it. So we have Goku level 1 through 4. For physicals, we have 3 Orange Uppercut, 3 Orange Launcher, uh, 3 Orange fo Refocus. Two orange quick dodge, the one wall breaker for energies. We have the three overpowering attack, uh, the one blinding. Um, for non for setups, we have the two vision to pass, and then for more energies, he has uh, three orange offensive strike, uh, three orange power point, three precise shot, three stare down, uh, three absorption, three energy catch, and for events, we have three Kaioken, three confrontation, uh, two orange destruction, Yamcha. Uh, the one time, and for his drills, he's playing two steady drill, two aura drill, two possession drill, um, sorry, um, burning aura drill, two possession drill, two aura drill, and uh, he has one phasing drill, hiding drill, focusing drill, and uh, his posse, his squad. So, Trunks, Yamcha, Tien, and Chi Chi. So, uh, tell me about the deck. Right, so the deck basically runs like like your new deck, except uh, since I'm running Goku, I have more access to the ally, so I included the uh, best of Yamcha card. Mm -hmm. um, Yamcha. Yeah. Other than that, it's pretty much standard. The only new cards that went in from set 2 is the Possession Drill, yeah. which is now the MVP, MVP card of the deck. Yeah. Goes no. through the bad hands. Now, what about like the other drills? You just found that they were just like subpar? So because obviously you can't play Drive and Drill because you have allies. Yeah. But what about the one that does stages? You just rather do life yeah. instead? I mean, the they're, they're good, but I feel like they're gimmicky at best. So I try to not run the two techie ones. Because here I run the one, what is this, phasing drill, yeah. hiding drill, and the focusing drill. And I feel like these are all superior to the ones that came out. That you need, two. for sure. Now, um, is your game plan to stay at level one, or do you try to like go up to three or four? Or? I try to go up to two, uh, get my setup with drill. <laughs> And then I'll usually level back down to one because Goku one has the energy attack. I try not to uh, Kaioken more than once because as you see I only run six energy blocks and the six physicals. Mm -hmm. I don't have much energy. I run a lot of endurance, so I try to just eat everything. So I have the inherent blocks here. Um, yeah, it's yeah, just very beat down. You know, if I use all my stages with Goku, mm -hmm. then I go on to my allies. Yeah. Uh, Tien's really clutch. So yeah. I see Yamcha with all the yeah. black decks running around. Yeah, so I saw you did some nasty combos with Yamcha. I know everyone makes fun of him because he gets beat by Magikarp, but uh, <laughs> you know that... Um, yeah, can you tell us some combos like this yeah, with Yamcha? Like, like Yamcha, Yamcha and Phasing Drill. If they let Yamcha hit, then you suddenly lose two setups slash drills. He also hits allies, so I'll spin one back, and this you can lower his attack to destroy one. And so energy that costs one for four, one and then there's four life, yeah, and if you have four. aura drill, it's you know six, so that's it's pretty powerful. So Yamcha's actually legit, and it just uh, seems like it's pretty solid build. Is there anything that you would change in the yes, deck? Yes, there's some cards I'm missing. I definitely run more wall breakers because orange doesn't really have any anger control. Mm -hmm. I'm thinking about cutting a Kaioken, um, possibly cutting out the trunks. Mm -hmm. I mean, he's nifty, but so how was Trunks? Was he? He was just like, ah, uh, like. It's okay. I mean, he's also gimmicky, so it's like you got to look at the top card. But I mean, yeah, it's not worth that slide. You yeah, rather? It's not worth it. I'd rather run like uh, what's his name? Yeah, yeah. Chao Tzu or something like that. Who does damage? Now the great debate with Orange in terms of like this card, um, offensive strike. So I know it does have. It works really well with Phase and Drill since it's kind of like you just blow up their whole field. But do you feel like it's? more like a gimmicky card like you'd say or you rather like that's the thing it's gimmicky but once you have the setup it works really well like early game is really crap like even if you hold it it's just two damage three times yeah it's not not very impressive but once you have the setup of like aura drill, drill and then phase and drill or something like six, that you suddenly have three attacks that do what is it five mm -hmm. lines yeah so all for one stage and stuff like that. Now, um, would you say like your MVB card would be like Orange Destruction? Would you say it would be Uppercut or what would you say like your... definitely this card? Oh, that card. Position drill. Yeah, by for sure. far. Yeah, this card is amazing. I mean, even if you don't have the drill with this card, if yeah. they enter on you and you draw something like a block, block attack, 
and you know they're like running black and they're just playing very passive and you don't really need to hold on to the blocks especially because you have the drills up on board yeah. you just possession drill try to swap off your draws i mean your blocks or attacks yeah or, or vice versa maybe you're not at enough stages and you draw attack so you can activate possession drill or pressure drill. now um with goku do you normally like use his effect or do you feel like i guess against black it's hard because you're losing a card and you might lose another card yeah, for the mastery yeah, yeah, so yeah, yeah, he has a problem that's the thing. Like, if I go against Black, it's just like a bluff. I swing with Goku, see if they block it. If they yeah. let it hit. If I don't have a setup on board, I'll yeah. trigger it. But other than that, yeah. it's more like an like empty swing. Now, what would you say like the weakness of this deck is? Um, it's like very aggressive. Uh, I, I feel like it... The weakness is probably just Goku. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so he's, he's, he's the really main guy is the weakness. <laughs> I mean, you know, he has to hit, and then on top of that, he has to discard. And yeah. then you go to two is not bad because it fishes you out stuff, but he doesn't have an attack. Mm -hmm. uh, so you you either have to go to three, which means you have to mill six of these because that's the yeah. only way he's gonna go up or uh, level back down to go. Yeah, now, actually, what about like trying to like if you had like devour and drill to just get to level three, and essentially you're like using. It's like having Goku one, but with more of a buff that could potentially rejuvenate. Is that something that you might consider? Yeah, I did. I did try Devouring Drill, but what I didn't like about Devouring Drill is that it doesn't really work with this card because yeah. you end up holding the drill so you can trigger off Devouring. And a lot of time, getting to three is not as important as getting your setup out there and trying to beat down with two. Because that's that, that's what the deck tries to do. It just tries to get big buff numbers. Yeah. Just attack off, you know, get more attacks with your allies, trigger Tia and draw a card, and just a barrage of attacks. You only need like one good turn to thin their deck down. And just like that. Yeah, I feel like uh, Hunger Joe is kind of counterproductive. Two, two. No. Wait, now what about Destruction? Would you say um, this card is three of, or you like, think two is fine? I mean, I do want to run three because I just want to see it. I mean, yeah. With, if I even have four drills out, which on average I have about four or five at any one time, yeah, that's five to six cards of life damage. And during the end game, that's that's enough to kill. Yeah. But I don't want to see it early because it's dead. Yeah, and that's usually the dilemma. Like two to three life cards, and it's yeah. very subpar. Right? Subpar. So yeah, yeah. For sure. So I don't want to see it too much, but then during the end game, I do want to see it. So yeah, it's, 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 like it's, it's that number, you know, for sure, you know. So I guess experiment with it, but uh, you know. It looks so solid. I mean, like, Uppercut is definitely a, a brutal card. I mean, yeah. especially with the allies, because then you can lower yourself, let the allies take over, and still get, like, all these attacks off and chain off. Exactly. Now, um, I mean, you have no fear of Nappa. I know you haven't really played against much no, Nappa. Yeah, right? if I run into Nappa, well, I run into Nappa. Yeah, but I nothing. feel like the other orange cards can take care of Nappa. Then, I mean, or I can go up to two or three, then I, I keep the Kyle Ken. Yeah, and, yeah, and three, and just cycle through and stuff like that. Well, awesome. So this is KCM's Orange Goku deck, and you know I know a lot of people probably kind of dismiss Orange, but I think it's definitely one of the harder styles to build because of so much utility card. You have a drill for almost any occasion, which makes Orange Goku actually a hard deck to pilot because you can tutor and toolbox for almost anything you want, and everything might seem good in the scenario, but you always have to find what's best and optimal so uh, was that always ever a problem for you in terms of yeah I but, think I think learning the matchup is the hardest because you got to know which drills to pull out yeah because like in black yeah because in black you might think like hide and drill okay you have that out you know if you're playing against Krillin they can't crit you and then all their, their mastery doesn't do any life cards because it's minus two at the same time like you might want to get a stop or fa you know possession drill to get stuff early like just so much so I guess for you it just depends on the the player and the you know the matchup so right. Well, thanks again for the deck list. We appreciate it, and we'll see you in the future. All right, All right bye.